Hey Trojans, on today's show we'll have information for seniors cap and gown orders. Also on the program we'll find out what fall flavor or scent you prefer in our Trojan Talk segment. This and more coming up on Trojan TV News. Good afternoon and thanks for joining us. I'm Lainey Grego. And I'm Ella Legree. It's Wednesday, October 11th and here are your top news and announcements. It may seem far away, but graduation is just around the corner. With that in mind, Jocelyn's will be here on Monday, October 16th during homeroom to talk to seniors about ordering graduation announcements and getting sizes for cap and gown orders. Fall is firmly here and that means all the things that come with it. Trojan TV News reporter Dawson Bean hits the halls to find out your favorite flavor or scent of the fall season. I'm Dawson Bean, and today we're asking people what their favorite fall flavor is. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Not only is the answer apple cinnamon, I don't care a thing about pumpkin spice. All right. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Apple cinnamon. Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. All right. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. All right, thank you. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Apple cinnamon. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. All right. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Apple cinnamon for sure. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. Pumpkin spice or apple cinnamon? Pumpkin spice. Right. Thanks to everyone we interviewed. I'm Dawson Bean. Let's send it back to the desk. Thanks, Dawson. My favorite drink for sure is pumpkin spice. What about you, Lainey? Personally, I'm not a fan of fall drinks, but I do love fall weather. I bet it was nice and chilly outside for your assassin this morning. It sure was. Let's send it to Isla with more. Thanks, Lainey and Isla. So looking at our current forecast on this Wednesday, it's um, 80 degrees right now and mostly sunny. We're about to hit the high for today, hitting the high of 82 and a low of 62. So it's good to go, go outside when you're still in that nice warm weather. Let's take a look at our seven day forecast. Okay, so tomorrow it's gonna be 81 and a low of 60 with some clouds heading near us. And then on Friday, temperatures are gonna drop so that football game's still gonna be a little cold and it's gonna be a high of 66 and a low of 50. And then uh, over the weekend, it's gonna be the lowest temperatures we've seen with a high of 59 on Saturday and a low of 56, and a high of 56 on Sunday. Um, our, the temperatures are gonna be in the high 40s for the low, and it's looking like it's gonna be sweater season, so you can break out that fall attire. And that's all, back to the desk. Thanks, Isla. You know, Ella, how did the soccer team did la do last night? I'm not sure, but I'm sure they won. Let's send it over to Dawson with those results. Thanks, Lady and Ella. The boys' soccer team dusted off the loss last weekend and added another tally to the win column. They beat Staley last night for the second time this season by a score of 5 to no. Luka Andonovsky, Dagan Gar, Owen Kosky, Braden Nichols, and Jaden Karp scored the goals to lead the Trojans to victory and move their record to 12-1 on the season. The boys' swim and dive team won one and lost one yesterday at the triangular meet at Blue Springs. The team defeated Savannah 160-93 but lost to Blue Springs 146-140. The team also competed in the Blue Mountain Invite on Saturday and placed sixth overall. Jack Stanley took the championship in the 200 medley and finished second in the 100 backstroke. Rafael Rilina came in first in the 100 breaststroke and second in the 500 freestyle. The team is now 16-1 and one on the season. The volleyball team came up short last night to a strong Liberty team. The Trojans dropped the match to the Blue Jays three sets to none. They are now 9-12-2 on the season. There are no scheduled varsity sports competitions today. That's it for your Trojan sports update. I'm Dawson Bean. Back to you, Lainey and Ella. Thanks, Dawson. Here are your meeting reminders for this week. Dungeon and Dragons Club will meet today after school in room 413. Experienced and new players are all welcome. Math Club will meet after school tomorrow in room PC2. Girls interested in swimming or diving this winter should attend the informational meeting today after school in room 410. If you cannot attend, please contact Coach Haley in room 304. 
That's all we have for you today, Trojans. I'm Ella Allegri. And I'm Lanny Grego. Thanks for watching, and have a great afternoon, Trojans.